Hello, my Poke Padawans. Welcome to week one of the GPC against the Rhine Valley. Um, something. I've forgotten his team name already because I'm such, I'm such a wonderful person. Uh. <laughs> anyway, anyway, this is week one of the GPC against uh, against Rhine Pool. So. I did the team analysis, that's hopefully up by now. And you, you know, if you want to see it, you'll have seen it. So, uh, just me give him a quick good look at fun. Look at fun. Right, so he's brought Starmie, Miss Magius, Muck, Septar, Miltank, and Mesprit. So, I don't have to worry about Zardex, which kind of sucks because that's kind of why I brought Ditto. But, you know. Um, ah, we are recording. Sorry, so I, I, I thought for a second that it wasn't recording. Um, but yeah, so he hasn't brought Zardex, but he has brought the Starmie, so that's cool. So I think he's going to open with his Mesprit. Which kind of makes me want to open with Lycanroc just to get my... Um, just to get my spikes up. Or we could open with Mega Doom and just go straight for the Dark Pulse. I have returned. Right, so. He could have with Miss Mages, actually. See, he's probably brought the mill tank specifically for Chestnut. I don't really want to open Chestnut if he opens with Mesprit. Because then I'm just going to take a Psychic to the face. If I open up with something... Fragile, he's just going to explode on me. I'm going to open with Lycan Rock. We're going to go for those early rocks. If he opens with Sami, I think I might be able to hit speed because we're scarfed and I can go for a crunch. Which only really falls through if he's sashed. Mill Tank. Okay, that's unfortunate. Okay, so what's Mill Tank going to do? See, now I could go, I can go for the Stealth Rocks. Or I could switch straight out to Chestnut. Because Chestnut doesn't really care about what this thing wants to do. In fact, I could even go out to, yeah. Actually, Chestnut would be the best. But I kind of want my rocks. I want my rocks. But I'm not sure what Miltank's going to do, to be honest. Seismic Toss, maybe? I'm going to go for the rocks, because I'm rock type. I'm resistant to its hits. Oh! Oh, okay. Okay, so that's the game you're going to play. Alright, I'm going to switch out to Chestnut. I'm going to switch out to Chestnut and we're going to set some spikes up. Oh, going for the Toxic. Nasty. Nasty, nasty, nasty. Um, see, that just makes me want to switch out to Sand Slash now. Because I don't really want to be toxic. But at the same time, I kind of want to get a Toxic on this thing. Because I don't have any status removal. But he might fear. He might fear a fighting type move, which I do have, but it's like zero attack per. Hmm. Sand Slash would make the most sense, but if he's got Hidden Power Fire, I'm not going to enjoy that. And the only thing I can really do then is, is rapid spin. <sighs> See, Sandslash can't really do much to Mill Tank. I'm gonna go for I'm gonna go for a Toxic. I'm probably gonna get Toxic in return. Okay, star me. Okay. So Toxic Star me. Right, that's not the end of the world. So if I switch out to Ditto now. Because he's probably going to go for a Scold, isn't he? He is probably going to go for a Scold. So if I switch out to Ditto, we can take a Scold, and then it'll be a Speed Tie. Which means I can go for a Shadow Ball and hit pretty much anything except for Muck. So I'm going to go up to Ditto. Hopefully he doesn't go for Shadow Ball. Ice Beam, okay. Don't freeze, please. Thank you. 
Oh, he doesn't have Shadow Ball. Okay. Okay, he doesn't have Shadow Ball. We can go for T-Bolt. He has Surf and not Scold as well. Interesting. Um... Hmm. He's probably going to think I'm Scarfed. So I'm going to go... I'm actually going to go for an Ice Beam. Think he's going to switch out into the Sceptile. Mock. Okay. Can we get a Freeze? Freeze would be nice. Nope, no Freeze. Alright. Who to go to now? I think Sand Slash is our best option. Ow! Okay, that hurt. Well, there goes Ditto. Alright, so we're going to go into... I'm going to go into Sand Slash. I'm just going to go for EQ. Good to go for EQ. I don't think... Do you levitate, Mesprit? I can't remember if you levitate. I cannot remember. Hmm. I think he does. I kind of want to go for Elite Life. I'm going to go for Elite Life. He's probably going to go for a knockoff, isn't he? Let's star me. Oh, oh, Leech Life on star me. Yum. Nom, 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 nom. <laughs> we pulled it off. <laughs> yes, victory. <laughs> oh, I was hoping I could pull off this le the Leech Life on star me. That's so nice. That's so nice. All right, so we're we're down a mon each. Okay, so here's Miltank. So, what does Miltank want to do? Do you get Fire Punch, Miltank? Do you get Fire Punch? I kind of think he might. I kind of think he might get Fire Punch. I could Rapid Spin, but then it's just going to set up rocks again, isn't it? I could actually go into Star Raptor, couldn't I? You can't tops hit me because I'm... Because I'm, um... Steel type. I can either go into Chestnut and try and get a Toxic on this thing, or... Well, I can switch it to Star Raptor and go for the close combat. But he's probably going to go for a double edge, and I don't think I'm going to enjoy that, to be honest. I'm going to play it safe and go to Chestnut. Seismic Toss, okay. Okay. Alright, we're going to... I'm going to get a Toxic up. I'm going to get a Toxic on the scene. Hopefully, he'll switch out into... He might switch it to Mock, actually. He does switch into Mock. Well, that's unfortunate. That's unfortunate. Um, I'm kind of thinking of going for a Sword Stance, actually. Are we faster? Probably not. We're probably slower. Do I go for a Sword Stance? Or do I play it safe and switch back into Sand Slash? But then he could pursue, but I'm not going to take a lot from it. Let's switch into Sand Slash. Knock off. Okay, that's unfortunate. Let's just go for an EQ. Does he stay in? Probably not. He's probably. He he should really st switch into Mesprit. So I'm pretty sure Mesprit gets the Levitate, but then he might fear the lead slot again. I really don't think... really don't think he wants to take a lead slot. Did I didn't bring the thing? What? What thing? I don't know what thing they're referring to in the chest. Something that it didn't bring, apparently.
should have no idea what they're talking about, but yeah, let's just go with it. Let's just go with it. Okay, it's made, yes. Right. Right. Right, okay. Okay, so are you gonna go for a hidden power fire? I kinda of think you might, somehow. I kind of think you might. What's your speed? 339. Can't remember it. You're not faster than Mega Doom, are you? I could basically click for Flamethrower with Mega with Mega Hound Doom. Mega Star Wars. God damn it, guys! <laughs> Mega Star Wars. Even better than regular Star Wars. Um, but yeah, I'm pretty sure I can just come in with Hound Doom here and just click Flamethrower. Uh, we're not Mega, but we're still Dark Type. We still take Power Gem. Okay. I kind of want to go for Dark Pulse. I'm going to, I'm going to go for Dark Pulse. I'm going to go for a Dark Pulse. He does switch in. Oh, the Colber Berry. Nice. Very nice. Very well played. All right, then let's go into. Let's go into. Hmm. Who shall we go into? We could go into. Could go into Lycan Rock actually and click Crunch. Do we go into Lycan Rock and click Crunch? I kind of think we do. In fact, I could probably click Stone Edge. Stone Edge might, be, might be even better, actually. Just click. Let's just click Stone Edge, because he's got nothing that resists it. <laughs> Mega Hound is Garbo joined. How dare you? How dare you, sir? How dare you? Even though our Mega Hound went down without actually doing much of anything. Maybe I should have clicked Flame Tower after all. I mean, the only thing that really resisted Dark Pulse was... Muck. So I wasn't really losing too much by clicking Dark Pulse. I just wanted to make sure that I was going to take the Miss Mages out. Right, well, there's the Stone Edge. Oh, the Crit. Crit mattered. I don't think it did, but Crit mattered. Of course I hit on no guard. <laughs> Yeah, I'm not. I, I was tempted to tell them. I'm tempted to tell them that I'm no god. Ah, they know. <laughs> They're on to me. Alright, so what are you going to switch into now? Conceptile, take a stone edge. So I'm so worried that it might. Cut, it, I think Sceptile's kind of frail, but... Hmm. See, if he brings in Mesprit, that will definitely live. Same with Miltank. Miltank will definitely live. I think if he brings in Miltank, I'll switch into Chestnut. I mean, I still have, I still have Sand Slash. You can't do too much, especially against Miltank. But we can get rid of the rocks at least, if we need to. And we can, we can hassle Mesprit with Elite Slow. We can EQ the Muck, and we can Icicle Crash the Sceptile. It's just a shame that Sand Slash is so damn slow. Because everything outspeeds me. <laughs> I 
but um, at the moment we're level pegging. Okay, so I'm going to switch into... I'm going to switch back into Chestnut, I think. And then I'm just going to straight up click um, Drain Punch, I think. I need to weaken this mill tank. Actually, I could I could switch into Star Raptor because as you, yeah, I'm gonna click into I'm gonna switch into Star Raptor actually because if I switch into Chestnut, he's just gonna go straight into Muck. Curse Tank. Oh, I hope this isn't Curse Tank. I hope this isn't Curse Tank. That would make me very sad. Although, even if he is, I don't think he's going to be able to boost up enough to take two close combats. Especially if one of them's um, all out pummeling. Okay, Toxic. I kind of want to click regular close combat because I think he might switch. I think he might switch. Well, what I could do is click U-turn and go into Sand Slash, get rid of the rocks, and then come back in and see what happens. We can take another knockoff because we have lost the item now. I'm tempted to U-turn into Sand Slash, but part of me wants to close combat as well. I'm gonna I'm gonna U-turn into Sand Slash. Right, there's the muck. So we U-turn. I'm going to. Do we go into Sand Slash or do we go into Lycan Rock and just Stone Edge? Hmm. -mm. Yeah, it's going to Sand Slash. <laughs> so I can Rapid Spin now. If I Rapid Spin, get rid of the rocks, that basically brings... Yeah, I'm going to Rapid Spin, get rid of the rocks, because they are hurting Star Raptor. And if I get rid of the... Right, so I didn't expect that to kill, to be honest. Ah, oh, that didn't kill either. That's nice. So, I could click Leech Life, I suppose, and get a little bit of life, life, life back. Ah, the Shadow Sneak. Damn you. Damn you and your deception. But Shadow Sneak can't hit me because I'm, I'm Ghost. I'm, I'm normal and that's Ghost. So, I think what I'm going to do now is I'm going to U-turn and then switch into Chestnut. I'm going to switch to Chestnut. Hopefully he's going to bring in the mill tank again. And then I can sword stand to start drain punching. Or we could just go into Lycan Rock, I suppose. But Lycan Rock... Lycan Rock can do some damage, actually. If we just start stone edging things... I think if I just click stone edge, we can start doing some damage. Because realistically, what can Miltank do to Lycan Rock? Not a lot, really, I don't think. So I'm just going to just gonna click stone edge. He's going to get the rocks back up, isn't he? Seismic Toss, okay, fair enough. No Guard Focus Blast. <laughs> I don't even know whether Lycan Rock gets Focus Blast. To be honest. I 
Alright, so there goes Mild Saint. So now he brings in Mesprit, right? Except up. Okay. Uh, do I stay in a stone edge? I'm pretty sure this is gonna outspeed me. No, we are 433 speed. We don't we outspeed. Let's go for a stone edge. Let's do it. Boom. Oh! Oh that's not nice. That that's 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 not nice. <laughs> that's that's not very nice at all. Um, let's just click Stone Edge again. We should be able to take him down unless he's got Quick Attack. Plus three Quick Attack. Is he gonna? He's gonna kill the plus three Quick Quick Attack. Real Quick Attack Raptor. <laughs> Choice Scar Quick Attack. Let's do it. Oh, he had speeds. How do you do this? What shenanigans are these? Um, can we drain punch you? Can we kill you with a drain punch? Can we live it and kill you with a drain punch? We shall find out. Can we take the hit? We eat it like a boss. Om nom nom. Goodbye. Right, so you're going to psychic me. So I'm just, I'm, I'm literally just going to toxic. Chest, chest not OP. Okay, this this isn't good. Um, I'm just gonna do this. That's a nice beam. That's not nice. Just drain punch, go. Live it, live it. No, we don't live it. God damn it. Uh, I think we might actually lose. <laughs> Does. Do Z moves go through go through uh, substitutes? I think this might be game. I think he might have me. I'm pretty sure this doesn't go through, and even if it does, it doesn't kill. I'm gonna go for reveal infiltrator. <laughs> I I wish I wish so much. I don't think we can live an ice beam, to be honest. I'm gonna go for U-turn because it doesn't. I'm not gonna take any recall from that, and maybe by some miracle I can live an ice beam. What? What? What are you doing? What are you doing? Don't do that. No, don't do that. <laughs> don't, 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 don't do that. He's trying to stall me out with substitutes. I mean, he can literally kill me with ice beam. He can literally kill me with Ice Beam. The game is his. Nope, there's another substitute. I mean, I don't know whether this goes through. I'm going to try it because I've got nothing to lose at this point. Yes, the Z stone, the Z stone on the substitute. That was it. <laughs> See, so there you go, boys and girls. See, Z moves don't go through substitutes. That's unfortunate. <laughs> that was unfortunate. I wasn't expecting the ice beam on the mess bit, but fair play, fair play. Um, I think maybe if I played a bit more aggressively, I might have won, but it doesn't matter. I managed to get the Leech's Life kill on the Starmie with Sandslash. I don't even care. Don't even care. So, that was our week one match in the GPC against Ricepool. So, uh, I will leave his links in the description down below. So, I hope you guys enjoy this match. Um, yeah, it was uh, something to see. Literally deleted acrobatics from Sceptar before the match. That sucks. <laughs> <laughs> That's that sucks. Uh, sorry for not being predictable. Shrug.
So yeah, thank you very much for joining me for this video guys, I uh, hope you enjoyed it. It was a lot of fun to do, it was a lot of fun to do. I always preferred making uh, live live commentaries because, you know, post comms are a nightmare for me because my memory is such rubbish, so it's just easy for me to do live com. Um, how did I plan to beat Zardex? Ditto. <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god, there's a little, there's a little ditto emoji thing! Oh my god, there's a ditto emoji on the Pokedex showdown. I am impressed. <laughs> yeah, with a speed time. So anyway, anyway, I'm getting sidetracked. Thank you very much for joining me for this video, guys. Hope you've enjoyed it as much as I did. We will be back next week with uh, week two of the GPC against... I don't even know who my opponent is next week. Let me... Let me have a quick look. Week two, the Highland Houndooms are against the Toronto Star Raptors. So that'll be uh, that'll be something. So that'll be fun. So yeah, you guys take care of yourselves, and I will see you next time. Ta-ta for now. <laughs>